Okay. Let us sit comfortably. Sukhasana, Padmasana, Ardha Padmasana, whichever is comfortable for you. Roll your shoulders, make your spine erect, palms open to the ceiling, eyes closed. Take a few deep breaths. Inhale deeply. And exhale slowly. Inhale the vital energy. And exhale, relax. Take one more long deep breath in. And breathe out slowly and completely. Now let us chant Om three times, bringing your fingers to Chin Mudra. Breathe in for Om. 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 Slowly join your palms together. Om Sahanao Sahaviryam Karavavahai Tejas Vinavadi Tamas Tumavit Vishavahai Om Shanti 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 Slowly rub your palms. Up it on your eyes and looking through the gaps of the fingers, open your eyes with a beautiful smile. Okay, so today we will do Agni Sara Kriya. So, how we do Agni Sara Kriya? Agni Sara Kriya is one of the cleansing technique in yoga. It cleans, it is used for the cleansing of the abdomen. So, we we here we what we will do is we will be doing movement of our abdominal muscles. That is what we do. How we do that? We breathe out completely. We breathe out completely. And in external retention of the breath, we do this kriya. Kriya means cleansing. Okay. So, first I will show you. Actually, we can do it seated condition also or we can do it in a semi-squat uh, condition also. So, if you are doing in a seated condition, you have to keep your legs in siddhasana. Keep your legs in Siddhasana, okay? And bring your fingers inside like this. Bring your fingers pointing towards you, okay? And now you breathe out completely. Now you pull your abdomen in. When you are breathing out completely, you are pulling your abdomen, abdomen in, okay? Then do the chin lock. Lock your chin to the collarbone and then start doing slapping. You are doing the slapping of the abdomen, but you are not breathing. You are just breathing out completely and just concentrating only on slapping the abdomen. Okay? For sitting in a in seated condition, it might be slightly difficult. So in standing condition, semi-squat condition, if you are coming like this, in a semi-squat condition, again, keeping your fingers inside like this. Okay? Breathe in. Breathe out completely, then, then bring the chin to the collarbone 
and do the flapping of the abdomen. Just like how we do in Kapal Bhati, but here we are not concentrating on the breath at all because we are holding the breath. Okay, you can see the movement of the abdomen. You can see the movement of the abdomen. Okay. And once we are not able to do 10 or 20 times, we will be doing the flapping, then breathe in deeply. And again, start the process. Okay, let us start. Bring in your hands to inside and extend your hands. Breathe in deeply. Breathe out completely. Pull your abdomen muscles in and do the chin lock. And then do start flapping. Once you are not able to hold further, breathe in. Then again continue. Breathe in deeply. Breathe out. Then pull your abdomen muscles in and do the clapping. Breathe in deeply. Breathe out completely, then clap your abdomen. Okay, then one more thing we can do. This can be done in standing condition only. So wh what we do here is, again, coming here, okay, what we do is just lift your one hand up and the other hand up. What happens is this muscle, the muscles in the opposite direction gets activated. That when you lift this, this muscle moves here. It is like movement of the muscle this side and this side. When you are doing the flapping, what we do, we concentrate only mainly on the center part of the center part. In Nauli Kriya, what we do, we pull our abdomen is initially pulled inside. And when we do this movement, one side moves, one side of the abdomen moves and the other side of the abdomen moves. Okay. So here we go to fully pulled up condition. Then just do the lifting of the hand alternately. Keep lifting. Automatically the muscles will move. Automatically you will not know that. You can feel it, but the muscle movement Left and right. 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 And relax. So this is called as Nauli Kriya. We are here, we are not flapping the abdomen like this. Instead, we are just keeping our hands up and down by this, this side of the muscle and this side of the muscle moves. Okay, this is called Nauli Kriya. This also is again a cleansing technique for the abdomen. Okay, so next we will go for the warm up. Let us come to kneeling down position. If you are feeling any pain in the knees, please keep a pillow below the knees. Keep a pillow below the knees. Yeah. Now let us stretch our one leg, one leg to the side, just like how we do in Parigasana. How we do in Parigasana? This leg will be on the knee, so you should not feel a pain. You can keep a pillow. Then bring your hand to the side. Bring your hand to the sides, okay? And raise the other hand up. Raise the other hand up. Open your chest, look up. And then slowly bring your hand down, just like how we do the threading the needle. Raise up, breathe in, and breathe out, thread the needle. You are not going down, just hand is going inside. Breathe in up, breathe out, thread the needle. 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 Then come back to center. 
come back to center. Now hand on the hip, stretch your leg up and down. This is for hip movement. One, two, three, four, five. Then come back to kneeling down position. Come back to, if you want, you can keep a pillow below the knee, whichever is on the floor. Now stretch to the other side, just like how we do in Parigasana. And bring your hands by the sides and raise your hand up and open your chest, breathe in. Breathe out, thread the needle. Breathe in up, breathe out, thread the needle. Breathe in up. Breathe out, thread the needle. Breathe in up, breathe out, thread the needle. Then come back to center. Come back to center. Now do the lifting of the leg up and down. One, two, three, four, five. Then come back to kneeling down position. Then come back to kneeling down position. From here, let us come to Malasana and then slowly stand up. Slowly stand up. Okay. Now keeping your hands behind or like this. You can initially, initially you can keep your hands behind or like this. What we are going to do is lift your left leg up and hold Right elbow to the left knee, alternate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then come back to center. This time, what we are going to do? First time, we will be going with the elbow to the knee. Then second, finger to the toe, okay? Elbow to the knee, then finger to the toe, okay? Elbow to the knee, finger to the toe. Elbow to the knee, finger to the toe. Elbow to the knee, finger to the toe. Right elbow to the left knee, right fingers to the left toe, okay? Left elbow to the right knee, left finger to the right toe. Okay, now stretching your hands to the sides, do the same. Okay, bend elbow to knee, finger to toe. Okay, now this side, elbow to knee, finger to toe. Alternately, elbow to knee, finger to toe. Straighten up your hands, elbow to knee, finger to toe. One more time, elbow to knee, finger to toe. Come back, elbow to knee, finger to toe. Then come back to center. Now stretching your hands up, interlacing your fingers. Stretch your spine and come on your toes. Breathe in on your toes and breathe out down. Breathe in up, breathe out down. Breathe in up, breathe out, down. Now take a little gap between the legs and keeping your right hand on the right hip, raise your left hand up, breathe in, breathe out to the right, breathe in up, breathe out to the right, breathe in up, breathe out to the right, breathe in up, breathe out to the right. Left side, breathe in up, breathe out to the left, Breathe in up, breathe out to the left. Breathe in up, breathe out to the left. Breathe in up, breathe out to the left. Then come back to center. Bring your legs together and we will do the hip rotation. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and slowly relax. 
relax relax we will do surya namaskar six at a go okay come to the front end of the mat bringing your palms together om surya namaha breathe in raise your hands up arch your back Breathe out, bend from your lower back to Pada Hastasana. Breathe in, right leg back, toes stretched. Breathe out, Adho Mukha, downward dog. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out, drop your knees, chest in on the floor. Breathe in, scoop up to Bhujangasana. Breathe out, Adho Mukha, downward dog. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padhasthasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha, downward dog. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to a stomp. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Second round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Father Hastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plant. Breathe out to Ashtam. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Third round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Father Hastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Father Hastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtam. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, fourth round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahastasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plant. Breathe out to Ashtam. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in right leg forward. Breathe out left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti, left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Father Hastasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adho Mukha. Breathe in to plank. 
Breathe out the tongue. Breathe into Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in left leg forward. Breathe out right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Next round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out the Padasasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out the Adomukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out the Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out the Adomukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padasasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adhukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Sixth round. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahasthasana. Breathe in, right leg back. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in, right leg forward. Breathe out, left leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. Left leg. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padahasthasana. Breathe in, left leg back. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in to plank. Breathe out to Ashtang. Breathe in to Bhujangasana. Breathe out to Adomukha. Breathe in, left leg forward. Breathe out, right leg forward. Breathe in, raise up, arch your back. Come back to Samasthiti. And relax, relax for 30 seconds. Relax for 30 seconds. We will do the variation. We will do the Ujjayi breathing Surya Namaskar with little bit of variations. Okay? Okay. Ready? Yes. Okay. Breathing, raise up, arch your back. Breathe out to Padakasthasana. Now breathe in, right leg back, come to Ashva Sanchalana. And take one long jab breath. Now raise your left hand up. Raise your left hand up and take one long jab breath. Bring your left leg down, left, sorry, left hand. Now raise your right hand up and take one long jab breath. Come back to Ashwa Sanchalana. Now take your leg back and go to Adho Mukha Downward Dog. Now raise your left leg up. One long jab breath. Bring your left leg down and take your right leg up. One long ujjayi breath. From here, come to Adomukha and then come to plank. Now, drop your one knee and raise your left hand up. 
drop your one knee, right knee, and raise your left hand up. One long ujjayi breath. Bring your head, hand back and go to plank. Now drop the left knee and raise your right hand up. One long ujjayi breath. Then come back and go to plank. Go to plank. One long ujjayi breath. Then drop your knees, chest and chin onto the floor. Ashtanga, one long ujjayi breath. Then scoop up to Bhujangasana, one long ujjayi breath. Then twist, to, twist and look towards your legs. One long ujjayi breath. Then come back to Bhujang and twist to the other side and look towards your leg. One long ujjayi breath. Then come back to come back to chin to the floor and raise up and go to Adho Mukha Downward Dog. Adho Mukha Downward Dog and lift your left leg up. One long ujjayi breath. Then bring your left leg down, right leg up. One long ujjayi breath. Bring your right leg down and bring your right leg forward to Ashwath and Chalana. One long ujjayi breath. Lift your left hand up and look to the ceiling. One long ujjayi breath. Bring your left hand down, right hand up, look towards the ceiling, one long ujjayi breath. Then bring your hand down and bring your left leg forward, Pada Hastasana. Stay here for one long ujjayi breath. Slowly raise up, arch your back to Hastasana. Then come back to Samasthiti. We'll do the same thing with our other leg. Raise up, arch your back to Hasta Uttana. Bend forward to Pada Hastasana. Take your left leg back to Ashwath and Chalana. Now raise your right hand up, look towards the ceiling. And one long jab breath. Bring your right hand down and left hand up. One long ujjayi breath. Then come back to Ashwasan Chalana and take your leg back and go to Adho Mukha Downward Dog. One long ujjayi breath. Now raise your right leg up and bend and hold. Bend and hold. One long ujjayi breath. Then come back to Adho Mukha. Raise your left leg up. Bend and hold. One long ujjayi breath. Then come back to Adho Mukha. From here, go to plank. One long ujjayi breath. Now drop your left knee and raise your right hand up. One long ujjayi breath. Then come back. Take your left leg back and come to plank. Now drop your right knee down and raise your left hand up. One long ujjayi breath. Back again, come to plank, one long ujjayi breath. 
Then draw your knees, then chest and chin to the floor. Asanga, one long jet breath. Then scoop up to Bhujangasana, one long jet breath. Then twist to the left, one long jet breath. Come back to Bhujan and twist to the right, one long jet breath. Then come back to Bhujangasana and lift your body and go to Adhukha, downward dog. And reach your left leg up, bend your leg and hold. Stay here, one long jet breath. Bring your leg down, Adho Mukha. Raise your right leg up and hold. Bend and hold. Stay here, one long jet breath. Then go to Adho Mukha, downward dog, one long jet breath. Bring your left leg forward to Ashwa Sanchalana, one long jet breath. Raise your left hand up, look to the ceiling, one long jet breath. Bring your hand, left hand down, right hand up, look to the ceiling, one long jet breath. Then come back to Ashwatan Chalana, bring your left leg forward and come to Father Sasana. Stay here for one long jet breath. Raise up, arch your back to Hristavutthana, then come back to Samsthi and relax. 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 So today we will do core workout. We will do some core workout. Okay, so we will be lying down on the mat and doing it. Yeah. Let us first lie down and come to Thadagasana. Lie down on the mat and come to Thadagasana. Bending your leg. Bending your leg. Yeah. Now you are going to keep your hands by the side of the body. Palms are facing downward. Okay. Palms are facing downward and bring your legs to half table, table position like this. Your both the lower, both the legs, lower leg is parallel to the mat. Both the legs are parallel to the mat. Okay. Now, stretching your hands a little more to the sides. Okay. Now, push your both the legs to the right. Then come back to center. Push your both the legs to the left and come back to center. You are not dropping them down. You are just going as much as you can without dropping. Then come back to center. Okay? Go to the left. Then come back to center. Go to the right. Then come back to center. Go to the left. Come back to center. Go to the right, then come back to center. Go to the left, come back to center. Go to the right, then come back to center. Keep your leg positions right. You have to maintain that 90 degrees here between your body and the hip and the thigh also 90 degrees. Okay, go to the left, then come back to center. Go to the right, then come back to center. Go to the left, then come back to center. Go to the right, then come back to center. Then release your legs 
and stretch your legs down. Stretch your legs down and taking your hand support, slowly raise up with your core support. Raise up with your core support. Yes, super. Yes, super, super. Now bring your hands one above the other or interlaced and keep it at your chest level. Okay? Now twist to the right. Then come back to center. Twist to the left. Then come back to center. See to that your spine is straight. Twist to the right. Then come back to center. Twist to the left. Then come back to center. Twist to the right. Then come back to center. Twist to the left. Then come back to center. One more time. Twist to the right. Then come back to center. Twist to the left. Then come back to center. Then slowly again lie down. Again lie down. Lie down. Take deep breaths. Take deep breaths. Now what we will do? Bending your, bend your both the legs again like this. Okay. This time what we are going to do? You are going to bend one leg down and tap your toe then come back to the same position. Left leg down, tap your toe and then come back to the same position. Okay. Tap your toe then come back to the same position. Tap your toe, then come back to the same position. Tap your toe, then come back to the same position. One leg tap, one leg tap, then come back. The other leg tap, then come back. Try to maintain this 90 degree. Try to maintain the 90 degree. Left leg tap, and then come back. Little forward, go forward and tap. Then only you can maintain that 90 degrees. Left leg, tap and then come back. Yeah, super. Go tap your right toe, then come back. Tap your left toe and then come back. Tap your right toe, then come back. Tap your left toe and then come back. And then slowly release your legs. Release your legs. Now, we will do the crunches, but with a little bit of easiness, okay? So, keeping your hands, elbows are bent here, okay? Now, what we are going to do, you keep your elbows bent by the sides, okay? And then, Lift your left leg up and lift your right elbow to the knee and then come back. Come back to the same position. Left knee to the right elbow and then come back to the same position. Okay? Left, right, right elbow to the left knee, then come back. Left elbow to the right knee, then come back. Right elbow to the left knee, then come back. Left elbow to the right knee. Then come back. Left elbow to the right knee. Then come back. Right elbow to the left knee. Then come back. Right elbow to the left knee. Then come back. Left elbow to the right knee. Then come back. We'll do it five more times. One. Come back. Two, come back. Three, come back. Four, come back. Five, come back. Six, come back. Seven, come back. Eight, come back. Nine, come back. Ten, come back. And relax. Relax few, take few deep breaths. 
relax and take a few deep breaths. Okay, now you're going to bend your both the legs and bend your both the elbows. Initial condition is your knee and elbow are touching each other, okay? Knee and elbows are touching each other, okay? This is your initial position. This is your initial position. Knee is touching the elbow. Now, stretch your leg, one leg, right hand back, left leg back, and then come back, okay? Do it five times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then come back to this position. This is called as dead bug stretch. Okay? Now we will do the same thing with the other leg. Left hand stretch up, left leg stretch up. Then come back to the same position. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then come back to this position and slowly relax and come to Tadagasana. Relax and come to Tadagasana. Now keeping your hands by the side of the body. Now stretch your both the legs. Bring your bring to tabletop position first and then stretch your leg to 45. Then come down to 10, go to 45, then come back to tabletop. That's what we are going to do, okay? Stretch to 45. Go down to 10, then come up to 45, come back to tabletop. Stretch to 45, go down to 10, then come up to 45, then come back to tabletop. Stretch to 45, go down to 10, then come back to 45, come back to tabletop. Stretch to 45, go down to 10, Come up to 45, then come to tabletop. Stretch to 45, come down to 10. Come up to 45, then come to tabletop. Stretch to 45, come down to 10. Then come up to 45, then come back to tabletop. Okay? One more time. Stretch to 45, come down to 10. Come up to 45, then come to tabletop. And then drop and relax. Relax. Relax your knees, relax your... And take the Pilates breathing. Breathe in and breathe out through the mouth. Breathe in deeply and breathe out through the mouth. Let us go for the closing stretches, keeping your hands by the side of the body. Lift your hip up, lift your hip up and come to Sethu Vandasana and stay here, bridge pose. If you can, put your hands below, interlacing your fingers and little more raise your hip up with your core support and stay here. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then slowly bring your hip down. One more time, let us lift. Lift our hip up. This time, lift your one leg up to 90. So take support of your hip with your hands. Okay? Raise your hip up. Take support for your hip. And then raise your one leg to 90. And stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then bring down your leg and bring down your hip. With the left, we'll do the same with the left. Raise your hip up, come to bridge, take support of your hip and raise your leg up to 90. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Then bend your legs and come back. Come back to Tadagasana. And bend your both the legs and bring it close to your chest and stay here. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then slowly raise your shoulders off the mat and do the rocky. Rock up and down, up and down, up. And down, up, and down, up, and down. Then go to the left, center, right, center. 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 Center. Then come back to center. Relax your legs and take little gap between the legs. Raise your hands up and interlace in your interlace your fingers. Now bend your both the knees towards the left and look towards your right. Then come back to center. Both the knees to the right and look towards your left. Then come back to center. We'll do it five more times. Left to the left, then come back to center, knees to the right, look towards your left, come back to center, three to the left, look towards your right, come back to center, three to the right, look towards your left, then come back to center, three to the left, look towards your right, come back to center, Three to the right, look towards your left, come back to center. One more time. Knees to the left, look towards your right, then come back to center. Knees to the right, look towards your left, come back to center. Come back to center. Now put your one leg over the other. And if you can interlace, otherwise you can just leave it. Now do the same thing to the left. Come back to center, to the right, come back to center. This is called as Marakadasana. Stretch to the left, come back to center, to the right, come back to center. To the left, come back to center, to the right, come back to center. Then release your right leg. Put your left leg over the right and try to interlock at your elbows or just leave it. Then go to the left. Come back to center, go to the right, come back to center. Go to the left, come back to center, go to the right, come back to center. Go to the left, come back to center, go to the right, come back to center. And release your legs and bring your hands by the side of the side of the body. Stretch your hands. Now the last one, universal stretch. Spinal stretch. Bend your right leg, keep it over your left thigh and push your right knee 
towards the left and you look towards your right palm and stay here. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then come back to center. Release your right leg. Bend your left leg. Keep it over your right thigh. Push your left knee towards the right and look towards your left palm. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then come back to center and relax your legs and lie down in Shavasana. Legs apart, toes falling outwards, hands by the side of the body, palms facing upwards, nose pointed to the ceiling, eyes closed, your complete weight of the body is on the mat. Take a deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Now bring about a feeling of inner relaxation in the whole body. Concentrate on the body and become aware of the importance of complete stillness. Develop your awareness of the body from the top of the head to the tip of the toes and mentally repeat the mantra Om. Relax your body from the top of the head to the tip of the toes. Continue the stillness and complete awareness of the whole body. Become aware of the fact that you are practicing yoga nidra. At this moment, you should take a resolve, a short positive statement, a wish which you want to come true in your life. Make a wish and repeat it three times. Now we begin to rotate our consciousness by taking a trip through the different body parts. Repeat the part of your part in your mind and become aware of that part of the body. Become aware of your right foot, right ankle, right shin, right knee, Right hip, entire right leg, navel center, left foot, left ankle, left shin, left knee, left hip, entire left leg, navel center, Abdomen center, heart center, throat center, right shoulder, right elbow, right wrist, right palm, entire right hand, 
throat center, left shoulder, left elbow, left wrist, left palm, entire left hand, throat center, chin, lips, nose, right cheek, left cheek, right ear, left ear, right eye, left eye, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, eyebrow center, forehead, top of the head, relax your entire body, your whole body is on the floor. Become aware of the fact that your body is lying on the floor. And visualize this image in your mind. Become aware of your breath. Feel the flow of your breath in and out of your lungs. Your navel is raising and falling slightly with each and every breath. Your chest is expanding slightly with each and every breath. Just observe your breath. Now let us come to visualization. A number of different things will be named and try to visualize them to the best of your ability. A burning candle. An endless desert with sand dunes. An Egyptian pyramid, torrential rainfall, snow capped mountain. Temple at sunrise. Birds flying across the sunset. Red clouds drifting across the sky. Across above a church. Stars at night. Full moon. Smiling Buddha. Waves on a deserted beach. Watch the restless sea. Feel the gentle breeze from the sea. Now it is time to recall your sankalpa or the wish you made at the beginning of the practice and repeat it three times with the same feeling and awareness. Now relax all your efforts, become aware of your natural breath. Your body is relaxed, mind has also become calm and pleasant.
Stay there in stillness for a few more seconds. Slowly become aware of your surroundings and start making movements. Start wiggling your toes, wiggle your fingers. Stretch your legs, toes outwards. Stretch your hands above your head. Stretch your spine nicely. Then slowly roll over to your right side. And with the support of your left hand, slowly sit up. Slowly sit up with your eyes closed. In this calm state of mind, let us pray and bless this whole world, bringing your palms together. Oh, Sarve. Bhavantu Sukinaka Sarve Santu Niramaya Sarve Badrani Pashyantu Ma Kachi Dukha Bhagavi Shanti 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 Slowly rub your palms, generate heat. Pop it on your eyes and feel. Feel the warmth. Feel the energy. Now slowly looking through the gaps of the fingers. Open your eyes with a beautiful smile. Have a beautiful day. Relaxed? Yes? Okay. Bye-bye. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.